Welcome everybody. Playing um Blood and Truth. Been looking forward to playing this game for a long time. Ryan Marks. It's not buddy. looking good, is it? <sighs> I've had better days. <laughs> so are you. Name's Carson, but we'll get to that. You and I are on the same side, by the way. Right. But don't I get a lawyer? You don't need a lawyer. But you do need my help. Oh, for fuck's sake. You seem to have forgotten in all this excitement that you were in some serious shit. Look around you, Ryan. This is it. This is the rest of your life. Sitting in a fucking room. Looks nice. Gonna play it out. You're facing multiple life sentences. Terrorism, conspiracy, more murders than we could even count. So you don't want to talk? Okay. Let me tell you what I know. Ryan Marks. SAS Nomad Squadron. Oh, sheesh. Zero. This is Nomad 2 1. I've reached the compound. Going in. Over. Nomad 2 1, this is Zero. Negative. Wait for close air support, Owen. Zero, I'm the one on the ground. I'm telling you, we need to extract now. Negative, hold position, over. It's almost Nomad looks... Two, one, this is zero. You are green on to go. Over. Watch that. This almost looks like a, it's from a... Uh... That like stunt thing that's in a uh, that Indiana Jones stunt thing that's in a uh, Disney World. Weapon check. Weapon good. Ammo good. Oh dang. Holster. Train. I swear, I am doing that. There we go. Jeez. Oh, that's kind of cool. This will come in handy. Okay. Shit! How did you get in? Get the other! Uh. Under attack! 
Ouch. Ouch. Oh, where am I getting? Come on. There you go. I have to get used to that. that Just need to use my tools. Oh. tricks on you. Should I shoot? Okay. I think I'm starting to get a hang of that. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, no. I want that. How do I get back? This electrocute me. I can't get back to that. Where's the rest of the Wait, my 
Sounds like I'm in the right place. I told you go. Doors reinforced. Looks like I'm going in loud. Prime the charge. Oh, shot the good guy. Got a little too excited there. Try this again. <laughs> yeah. oh. You took your fucking time, skid marks. I thought I was gonna have to rescue myself. Oh, fair enough. I'll be off then, shall I? <laughs> you fucker, come on. Get these open. on seven to ten x-rays with longs and five x-rays with shorts. Best estimate. Okay, go. Comms check. Roger that. Weapon check. Ammo good. Weapon good. Safety off? Always. Firm. Move. Firm. Move. nest out there, mate. Stand by. Stand by. Stand by. Go. for game to reload. That's it, get in. Get in. Go. Barrio, brace yourself. Oh, this is nice, man. Let's go. Did you ever get your license back? <laughs> I'm gonna get up without saving it. Nice. What's your sex? Oh my gosh. Did I shoot my guy again? I did, didn't I? Damn it. My dad, my bad, Deacon. Oh, these fuckers aren't gonna give up without fighting me. Oh my gosh.
not the best you can do? Oh my gosh. This is a little harder than I thought it would be. Anymore? Hello Zero, this is Nomad 2-1, message, over. Nomad 2-1, this is Zero, send message, over. Zero, Nomad 2-1, the cat is in the cradle, over. Nomad 2-1, Zero, Roger, acknowledge, send the big man our regards, over. Roger that, over. He messes me. <laughs> Just being polite, mate. Oh, fuck off. This is Zero. We have an urgent signal from home. Nomad 2-1, report to HQ 3-0. On return to the FOB. Over. Roger that. <laughs> Out. Uh, call back to base. That doesn't sound good, does it? No. the intro huh got some bad news I'm afraid unfortunately your dad died heart attack over really quickly there's nothing anyone could have done I'm really sorry mate flights arranged so get your bags packed. You're going back to London. London streets, abundant greets. Buckle up, cause you got front row seats. Knuckle dusters just slump these chiefs. Round here, man not come from police. Don't get caught slipping in. London, don't forget, blood is thicker than water's dripping in. Sink into the bottom of the Thames if you do the payback what you owe. Best hope you can swim or I won't kid you, you're a crazy individual. But they ain't playing no games. They stay picky in the middle. And I ain't naming no names. Off the record or official, and you should say the same. Uh... Okay.
I could. Uh, this is a new car. Yeah, got it a couple of months back. It's all right, Nim. Yeah, it's very subtle. Fuck off. <laughs> You're still wearing a horrible ring. Yeah, of course. Where's yours? Oh, I lost it. Ooh, Mum's not going to be happy with you. Then. You'll never guess who I saw last week. Who? Gary Moss. <laughs> Gary with a small head. Yeah. <laughs> Looks even smaller now. <laughs> oh, I used to get the right hump about that. <laughs> In fairness, you did say it looked like uh, great with a face. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> what the fuck is that? I quit smoking. Carbs. Carbs? Yeah. Do you know an apple was basically one big carb? <laughs> so I've given up fruit. Well, what about beer? Uh, beer's not fruit, it's grain. <laughs> Here, try it. Oops. Oh, butter fingers. <laughs> How you been? Yeah, you know me. And how's mum doing? She just lost her husband. How do you think she's doing? Yeah. <laughs> it was fucking sudden, though. I don't think it's hit her yet. I don't think it's hit any of us. Yeah. Look, he was no angel, but I just thought he'd make it through to the end. No one big enough to take him on. Things were running smoothly. Then this. Still, better than a bullet in the head, I suppose. Heart attack doesn't sound too fun. Yeah, probably right. This goes to show, though, doesn't it? Go so what? Oh, I don't fucking know. Something profound. <laughs> I'm kind of digging this. This is this is getting interesting. It's good to see you, mate. Yeah. Good to see you too. Sure hope this game lives up to expectations. I was really looking forward to this. Right then. Should we get this over with? Yeah. You ready? Yeah. I'm ready. Come on then. I won't ask you about the funeral. We're no stranger to those. I just want to know what happened afterwards. It's easy to say a guy comes back from the army. Goes nuts, right? Seen too much, can't handle it, case closed. But we both know that's bullshit. I just want to know what went down, man. What's your story? You should write a book. My life as a massive dickhead. I might give you a chapter. If you would tell me something. Okay, I'll tell you something. Go fuck yourself. I mean, who's in charge here? <clears throat> I'll speak to them. Ryan. I am ex-Delta. We both know the same things. I'm here to help. You need to help me. Oh, uh, ex-Delta does pop psychology. You gonna ask me what I dreamt about last night? Sure. What'd you dream about last night, Ryan? Well, I was doing a speech naked, then all my teeth fell out. What do you think that means? This is a conversation. I'm not a cop. I'm not here to go after your family business. In fact, I don't give a shit about any of that. I know you're not a cop, because you've got CIA written all over you. Delta, really? Come on. You're just a fucking desk jockey. <laughs> is that what you think? Yeah, it is. Intel, analysis, mission reports will only take you so far. But if you want the reality of a tactical situation, you need to be on the ground. We both know that. Ground truth. Exactly. 
How many made it from your unit selection? Five. Plus you? Including me. They don't always take the best guy, but they always take the right guy. Wow. Was there a cliche test? I failed mine. Dog ate my homework. <laughs> <sighs> All right, Delta Force. You've convinced me. We can talk. Okay. Good. No problem, man. I'll take care of it. Thanks, Clint. Dad would have hated it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he would. Mum, it might be a good time to start thinking about yourself. Get out of this. You could go on a cruise, get a caravan. <laughs> caravan? I can't just leave. People counting on me. What about Nick and Michelle? Mum, Nick's 34 years old. I think it'd be all right. <laughs> You know what I mean. I'm serious. Maybe you should step away. Dad wouldn't want you worrying about the business. You know what your dad would have wanted? Everyone to get out so he could watch the snooker. <laughs> he was so proud of you. You know that, don't you? I know. God, you look just like him. He wasn't much younger than you when we met. When was that? 1937. He was a lot funnier than you, though. <laughs> What's going on? Whoa, oh. whoa. Stay behind me. Get in! They're all over us. All right, all right. Ah! Put the weapons down. Now! Oh, fuck. Clint, do as she says. Don't move. Listen, love. You don't know who the fuck you're dealing with. Just put the gun. Fuck. Okay, it's clear. Who are you? He moved. Anne, do you know I am? <laughs> yeah, of course you do. For those of you that don't, my name is Anthony Sharp. I'm a businessman. And like all good businessmen, I like to seek out new opportunities. Oh, for fuck's sake. I've just buried my husband. Yeah, I know. And it's a terrible thing. But like I said, new opportunities. The thing is, it's very difficult getting you all together. And my offer is for the whole family. Yeah, can we hurry this up, Tone? I've got a date tonight. You open your fucking mouth again, and I'm gonna put a bullet through her face. What is it you want? What do I want? Your operation, all of it. Networks, assets. Oh, come on, I don't need to tell you how this works. You've done it plenty of times yourselves. You just keep on doing what you're doing. Think of it as a merger. Apart from you, you can fuck off back to the army. And I know what you're thinking. You're tempted to push back, but I strongly advise against that. I don't want this to be a hostile takeover. I'm sure you don't. I've got a lot of respect for you, Anne. You're a clever woman. You'll do the right thing. Right. Well, I think I'm just about done here. This is my brother Keach. He 
He's the absolute best with numbers. And he's going to make sure that this transition runs smoothly. Right. I need ledgers, receipts, contact books, diaries, you name it. I want to know when you last saw your fucking proctologist. Come on, chop chop. Someone clear that up. The Sharp Brothers. They've done well for themselves. I get why they want your family business. I mean, it's the best network in Europe, but... It's an area they have zero expertise in. Do you have a history with Tony? Yeah, we knew him. He had his thing, we had ours. But he's never a problem. So why now? He saw an opportunity. An opportunity? Mm. On the day of your dad's funeral? That guy is a total asshole. We've done worse. You're right. We have. Oh. <laughs> there was one thing we've all been wondering. What's that? How the fuck did you get out of there? <laughs> <laughs>